Well, what are you doing at 5.25? Because there's a bit of a celebration going on, a special tribute in honour of the 3,000th edition of Countdown, which is coming up right now. So stand by, here's Richard to do the honours. I go swimming every day, winter or summer. It's uh, very nippy. On the whole, it's cheaper than lager, but it's a marvellous cure for a hangover, and it's a wonderful kickstart to the day. Countdown Cholesterol with Flora Proactive. Thank you very much everybody and welcome well you know it seems like only yesterday when uh, countdown burst forth upon a grateful nation but then it was november the 2nd 1982 and here we are celebrating yes another anniversary yes today everybody i'm sure you know by now but we're delighted and thrilled and proud that today is the 3000th edition of countdown Who would have thought it? But uh, by my reckoning, uh, over 162,000 letters have been selected by the contestants. This clock here, this famous clock we've got, has ticked away for over 208 hours. And our studio audiences, our live audiences here, have totaled over a third of a million. So a third of a million people have been in the studio to see me and Cal. Can you imagine it, Cal? <laughs> no, frankly. And we, <laughs> and we still live to tell it's the tale. It's probably more than status quo. What do you think? That's right. Now, in all that time, some of our contestants we've had on weren't even born uh, when our first show was transmitted, mm -hmm. obviously. And our oldest ever contestant, who is called Bertha Born, in fact, will soon be celebrating her 95th birthday. So, well, uh, I myself and Carol, of course, and the whole Countdown team would like to thank uh, all of you, our loyal viewers, uh, and the contestants, of course, the celebrities, uh, but especially, dear viewers, you, for all the support uh, that you've given us over those 2,999 editions. So we applaud you. We're going to applaud you. Yes. 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 So let's meet and greet our two contestants who will be battling it out for the distinction of being champion of our 3,000th edition. So we've got champion Paul Hawkins and challenger Raymond Reese. Well, Paul so far has put in a champion performance, two good wins with the scores of 48 and 54. He works for the Inland Revenue, uh, but faces, frankly, a taxing time today as he takes on the challenge of this chap, Raymond Reese. Raymond lives in Pitsy, in Essex. He's now retired, having worked for many years as an engineer for British Telecom, BT. He enjoys messing about on the water and has his own boat on the Norfolk Broads. He also says his favourite song is Bridge Over Troubled Water. But he hopes he's not quieting in his beer at the end of the show. So good luck to Raymond Reese. <laughs> well, it's quite an emotional occasion today, I suppose, ladies and gentlemen. As you reflect on life and as you pass through the departure lounge of the airport of life, you may, you may experience a certain uh, sense of loss. But fear not, intrepid traveller, for though you may mourn the passing of duty free, you and Tanya Stiles from the OUP. We'll be able to console yourselves with the fact there is no tax on watching and listening to the peerless Keith Barron. Welcome back, Keith. Thank you. Um, thank you, Richard. It's lovely to be here, and indeed it's an honour to be here on the 3000 episode, to be here with the beautiful Carol, and indeed with my correspondent, Tanya. Oh, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> the correspondent. Well. I'll tell you later. <laughs> right. Well, when you say it's lovely to be here, uh, Keith, I think what you really mean at your age, it's lovely to be anywhere, actually, isn't it? <laughs> That's very cruel, I'm Richard. sorry, just in the spirit of the day, Keith, no offence meant. All right, I remember that. <laughs> Got enough slap on. <laughs> <laughs> OK, well, here we go. Uh, in party mood, here we are, Paul and Ray. Off you go, Paul. Uh, Consonant, please, Carol. OK, thank you. We start with D. And a vowel, please. A. Another consonant. H. And another. T. 
and another N and the vowel E uh, consonant G and another consonant V and the vowel and I Okay, thank you. I now start the clock. With great pleasure. Okay, now then, Paul. Seven. Seven. Paul, Ray? Seven. Right, Ray, seven. Heading. 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 Yes, Ray, Paul? And evading. Evading. Evading and heading. Yes, we have seven Yep, very good. There. All there for evading and heading. Uh, Chania, very cleverly, has got another seven, which is, in fact, vintage, as in wine. <laughs> Nothing. Okay? <laughs> Yes, vintage there, fine vintage. Like Excellent. Countdown is a vintage Probably. show. <laughs> Still nothing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, off the mark in fine style with seven and the seven chaps. Now, Ray, your turn, please. <coughs> Consonant, please, Carol. Thank you, Ray. R. And a vowel. E. A consonant, please. S. Another one, please. Y. Um, vowel. O. Consonant. L. Another consonant, please. C. A vowel. A. And a consonant, please. And L. Right, 30 seconds and counting. Yes, Ray. Seven. Seven again, Paul. Uh, I'll try an eight. Good man. Right. Seven, Ray is locales. Yes, locales. That's this. Uh, you're getting the nod from Tanya. That would have been okay. Uh, now we have an eight, though. Coarsely. Spell it, please. C O A R S E L Y. Yes. Very good. Excellent. Yep, that's a good one. We'll just that. put it up on the board and give him a round of applause because I think that's going to get the points. Yes, well done. <laughs> Coarsely. Did that we, beat you, Keith? It, well, I'm afraid it does. We do have a seven, thanks to Tanya, which is recalls. Mm. You could also have had callers, but that's only another seven. We, we didn't beat that. No. Well, that, excellent. Well done, Paul. So that's uh, eight to you. So you move on to 15, and it's seven to you, Ray. And Paul's letters, please. Uh, consonant, please, Carol. Thank you, Paul. T. And another. S. A vowel, please. U. Consonant. D. A vowel, please. E. A consonant. R. A consonant. N. A vowel. I. And a consonant, please. And P. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> 